What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. I just want to give you a quick hit of this wallet here. This is a new buy W3 MagSafe wallet, and it will stick to the back of your iPhone that has MagSafe, and it's pretty expensive. But I thought that this might be my new wallet. It comes in this little tin. Actually, when I ordered it and looked at it, I was like, is this a cocktail in a tin or something like that? But I know that it's a wallet because it says it on the outside. So it comes packaged like this. And here are some instructions. Now, if you're an EDC carrier or you are a little bit of a prepper or you just like being prepared, this wallet might not only be practical, but it also might be able to replace some of the other tools that you're carrying. So first of all, we get this little carrier here. And as you can see, this will slip over this elastic band. And what you can do is you can put an air tag under here. So if you do lose this, you can hunt it down, right? So if you use Apple air tags, then this is going to be your friend. It would go on here just like that. And then you would put the air tag under here and it would kind of be sandwiched between this little, very light. I'm not sure what kind of alloy this is. Well, I think it'd be titanium, but definitely could be. But that air tag will be sandwiched between here and this elastic band. Now, I also want to show you here that it's actually pretty thick. I want to say it's about a half an inch thick. So you've got to understand that it's going to be a little bulky right out of the gate. But for that, on this piece right here, we will get the mag safe. So you'll get the magnets in there. We have this little recess cut out. And then what's also interesting is we get one of these EDC cards. So you can see it's just being held down by the elastic band itself. And it's being held in place and indexed by the little screws that are popping up hovering above this carbon fiber backing. So what you get here is like an EDC card on top of this, which you can use for a lot of stuff. You've got wrenches, you've got a ruler, you can loosen nuts, you, you can open bottles, you've got screwdrivers on this end. So just a lot of stuff. I can't tell you all the stuff that would be on here, but these are really great for tightening up bike parts or taking small nuts off things. These things can be nice. So it's your choice to put that there. But like I said, the little holes right there, which will hold it in place, but it's not attached. So you can just pull it off just like that. Now, I just want to show you here. That's a really nice, like matte dry carbon fiber backing there. It's not that heavy. It's got a little bit of weight, like weight, obviously from the magnet, but weight saying, hey, this is nice construction, which is kind of what you'd expect for $50. There's a little loop right here. So you could put a lanyard on there if you want it. It also gives you a nice little opening here so that when you put cards in here, so let's say I slide a credit card in here just like this. What we have is a little place where I can thumb that out, right? To be able to grab it. So a nice intentional design. And it still gives me some space here to put that lanyard on there if I want. Now, one thing I want to show you here is it opens up like this. Have another elastic band right there. You have a carbon fiber inside. That actually might block some of the RFID. I know that carbon fiber is not necessarily designed to do that but it does intercept a lot of signal, which is actually why you don't see a lot of carbon fiber cases for phones because it can screw up that signal. And then I want to show you here on the bottom, we have another elastic band right there. The cards or your business cards, your IDs are not going to slide out the back. They're only going to come out this top and you're going to know that the top because it's opposite this hole here. So you could put cash on the outside here and then attach it to your phone on the back here, just like that. And because this expands, I think the nice thing is it's going to allow you if you have five cards, two IDs, 10 cards, and maybe some business cards, it's going to adjust to different needs here. So the nice thing about this is that I think you get a lot. You can have that safety of the AirTag, get a little peace of mind with this EDC card, but then also carry everything that you need in a nice little compact wallet that will be attached to your iPhone. So if you want to pick up this MagSafe wallet, I'll put a link to it in the description below. Peter Von Panda. Out. We can discover more and explore so much deeper. We can live better than ever things to Peter. Peter Von Pe